The supraspinatus is the most commonly torn portion of the rotator cuff. It originates from the supraspinous fossa of the scapula and inserts upon the greater tuberosity of the humerus. As the supraspinatus contracts, it contributes to abduction of the arm at the shoulder. A tear of the supraspinatus tendon can result in pain and weakness in the shoulder with attempts to abduct the arm. Job's test, also known as the empty can test, can aid in the diagnosis of supraspinatus pathology. The test can be performed with the patient sitting or standing. The patient is instructed to abduct the arm to 90 degrees in the scapular plane. The scapular plane is angled about 30 degrees forward. The arm is also internally rotated so that the thumb is pointing down. This gives the appearance of holding a can upside down to empty it. The examiner then applies a downward force at the patient's wrist or elbow and instructs the patient to resist it. The test is considered positive if there is pain or weakness as the patient attempts to hold the arm up against the examiner's downward force. The empty can test has limited specificity, sensitivity, and inter-rater reliability. However, it can be helpful in identifying supraspinatus injuries when combined with other physical exam tests, such as the full can test and arm drop test. MRI can be used to confirm the presence of a tear.